Hi Grade 12 student, so in this video we are going to discuss inventory. So I took a question paper which was written in 2022, uh, the province it was Eastern Cape, okay? So it was question 3. So I picked this question because it's different with the previous one that we covered under this topic of inventory, okay? Let's look at the question that we have, okay? This question paper also contain a donation. It's very rare to find a donation under this topic, but I'm going to show you how you are going to complete this, okay? They said you are provided with the information on happy heads and the business cell sun heads. They use a periodic inventory system and the weighted average method to value their stock. The business is owned by happiness, Nelson, uh, the manager is responsible uh, for the day to day running the business. So happiness is the owner and the uh, Nelson is the manager. Number one, you are required to calculate a value of closing stock on 28 February 2022 is 10 marks and you are required to calculate gross profit as well. Okay, let's go to information and calculate our closing value. Remember they said that this business is using weighted average method. Okay, 3.1.1, 3.1.1, weighted average method. All right, you know, when we calculate weighted average method, we're just going to take all totals, divide by, divide by number of units. Okay, the first total that we are going to take is opening, which is 63, 140, and we add with purchase, which is a uh, total is 328, 308 okay and we check if we have any written yes we have different written which in total is 3740 minus 3740 so if you check other previous question papers you will find that this was the last part that we end but now because we also have a donation number d 20 sun heads from, 20, from May 2021, bench were donated to local school who took learners on educational tour. So in other words, this uh, is not uh, available for sale. Remember, average, weighted average, we only uh, calculate item which was available for sale. So this donation is, is no longer with us. We have to subtract it. But they give us only 20. This is not value. 20, we are going to write it here when we divide. But here we want what a total value. So this 20 is from May bench. So let's go to May bench and check the price. May, it was costing 135 plus 10 rand of carriage, which means that it was 145 in total because there was a carriage. If there was carriage, it's like a transport cost. We have to include it, which means that you are going to say 20 multiplied by uh, 145. 145, we got it by saying 135 plus 10. Simple. Okay. If you calculate this, it's going to give you amount of 2,900. Okay. Now we have to write the unit of those amount that we, 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 we take. Okay. Opening balance, it was 4, 12, plus uh, uh, purchases of 20, 10, and we subtract return of 22, and we also subtract 20 of donation. Okay, then in total, on top, we are going to get 384,830, and the other bottom side, 2,380, and we have to multiply by closing stock a closing stock we have 320 units then now we can get our total uh, of 51,740 comma uh, 8 which we can round it and it said 41 this is our closing stock so if you do this guys it's going to give you 10 marks a lot of marks are here you have to make sure that you show everything. 10 marks for free. Okay. The next question, we have to calculate a gross profit. Formula, it says sales minus 
cost of sales. Okay, let's first identify the sales. Number E, 1,986 heads were sold during the financial year and the selling price was 220, which means that you need to, to multiply. Okay, so if you multiply these two, you are going to get amount of 436 and 920. Okay, after that, you need to subtract a cost of sales. A cost of sales, because we are using a periodic inventory system, we need to calculate it using a formula, which says opening plus purchase minus closing. Our opening, uh, we had 63. Okay, let me just show it here. Opening, 63, 140 plus purchase of 328 330 minus the return of 3740 and minus 2900 of donation and minus closing of 51741 this calculation is going to give you a cost of sales uh, which is amounted to 333089 then if you say sales minus cost of sales is going to give you a gross profit of 103,831. Just like that. That's how you should complete uh, this six marks. It was six marks. This one and this one is 11 marks. So make sure guys that you have subscribed to this channel so that you will get more videos. Those who want to join our extra class just text us on WhatsApp so that you can be able to also consult on whatsapp if you are part of our extra class however guys you can also join on a youtube we have a, you, a, a option which uh, if you can see it is it is written join so you can also join so that you can watch a uh, members videos as well if you don't want the one that we do on whatsapp and also a telegram okay Let's proceed. Now, we are going to theory part. I always say this. When it comes to inventory, guys, don't ignore a theory part because you are just going to calculate some few calculations and after that, they want you to explain something. Okay. 3.1.2. 3.1.2. Uh, they say the happiness discovered that Nelson had stopped buying from their regular supplier of heads in August 2021 without informing him about his change. He also discovered that the new supplier is Nelson's cousin. Okay, then now the question says, what advice can you offer happiness in this regard? State to point. The owner guys find that the manager uh, is now buying uh, to his cousin. In other words, he changed the previous uh, supplier to to his cousin so that he can also do what benefit so now uh, what can we advise the owner in this case we need to advise the owner uh, what we can do okay to avoid this situation number one manager must be given a warning must be given a warning okay then another one um, company must purchase to a supplier with better price and better quality okay as a company guys we don't have to focus on favor of someone we need to focus on what can we do to make our customer happy which means that our product must be in of quality okay so you can give so many uh, examples guys there must be a policy as well 
the company must reach, write down the policy that this is not allowed. You don't have to include your personal interest into a business. Okay. Uh, it was 4 marks. So, 1.2 marks. Okay, then the next part, uh, 3.2, management of stock and problem solving. In addition to sun heads, happiness heads also sell sunglass and uh, beach bags. Okay, information from their stock record on 28 February 2022 is provided. Number one, required number one, 3.2.1. Because of problem with stock theft, Happiness has installed security camera. And despite this, he thinks that sun heads are still being stolen. He installed the camera, but he's thinking that no man, people are stealing uh, the stock. Okay, then provide a calculation to verify that sun heads are being stolen and give two points of advice to Happiness to address this problem. Okay, we need to calculate and be sure that uh, the heads are being stolen okay let's take the information of head number of opening uh, okay let me write it 3.2.1 number of heads at the beginning it was 4 12 and the uh, the one that we purchase and return it was 1968 it's like a net purchase after we return okay and now we have to subtract what we sold which is 1986 and after that we have to subtract a closing of 320 okay so this will give us a number of goods that have been stolen which is 74 units Yes, now we can con confirm to the owner that uh, 74 units has been stolen. Okay, now to advice. We have to give two advice. Okay, let me rub here so that we can have space. Advice, we need to give advice now. Ad advice number one, we must improve, we have to improve a security okay number two we must have regular stock count number three okay actually they were looking for two but let me give you another one we must have restriction restriction of access to storeroom where we put our so guys, we have to make sure that no one just enter there. Okay, I think that's it. So let's go to the last one. Uh, happiness is unsure whether he's charging the correct price for the sunglass and the beach bags is other two product. Okay, give him advice on each product and quote the figure. Okay, uh, let's check. Let's start by sunglasses. Let's start by sun. Sunglasses. Okay, under sunglasses, uh, if you can check a markup, guys, it's charging 25% only. And the goods that has been sold, okay, you check a markup. Makeup is 25%. Okay, another point. He sold, he sold 1,850 units and a stock holding is 52 days in other words he spent only 52 days to sell this stock okay and the closing stock was only 208 this uh, indicated that most of people are buying this goods and this goods is uh, 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 we can advise the owner that he can keep charging this price because everyone can be able to do it to afford it but if you check beach bags okay beach bags if you check the markup guys 80 percent is charging 80 percent markup and if you check a uh, stock holding period it's 163 days he took 163 days to sell this good which means that these goods are expensive 
So now we can advise the owner that he must reduce this markup because most of people are not buying these goods because they are very expensive. So that's how you should trade inventory, guys. Please make sure that you subscribe, like this video, share with friends so that this channel will keep growing as we keep assisting many and many more South African students who are doing grade 12. I will see you on the next upload, guys.